cooking anything that needs to be crispier in the oven, when you are cooking something that renders fat, or even roasting big pieces of meat, this is the tray you reach for. Really, I designed this tray <clears throat> for two purposes. For extra crispy oven fries, um, so the heat can circulate all the way around um, the fries and they crisp up even quicker than they would on a flat sheet tray. Right. And because I always tell people to bake their bacon. If you work in restaurants, you know that there's no such thing as putting bacon in a frying pan. A, it makes <laughs> a mess. B, it splatters and injures the cook often. Um, and C, you just can't cook a large amount of bacon easily. Right. So you put it on a slotted broiler pan and bake it, it crisps up evenly, all the fat drips away, and you don't have to turn it. And it doesn't make a mess of your stove. Um, the problem for most people is that they lost the broiler pan or destroyed the broiler pan that came with their ovens right. years and years ago. So this is really designed to replace that. You could bake your bacon, the fat drips away. You can cook your French fries. I'm gonna go grab some. And uh, they'll stay uh, crispy on both sides. Um, and when you make cutlets, I keep my cutlets warm in the oven. Chicken cutlets, eggplant cutlets, if you're making a giant parm or big right. family style meal. Sure. So again, the heat can circulate and it doesn't, the products don't get sweaty underneath. Well, it's like convection. Well, it is convection cooking because right. what's happening is the air is able to circulate around the food. Now, um, a true convection oven would have a fan forcing that air around the food. In this case, even if you don't have a convection oven, it kind of turns your oven into a convection oven. Now, but I'll even tell if you you're just making nachos, oh, sure. these don't have our silicone handles on them. It's just a straight up metal baking sheet, so it can go under the broiler, under of the course. Broiler, yeah. With silicone, you can't put it under the broiler because it will melt. Exactly. You have to cover it with foil. So this is great if you love to make nachos. You can roast chickens on it and use. But the look, chip two big chickens. Yeah. I mean, this is a, a 10 by 15 size. Now, Rachel, when we, you and I had this on back in April and it sold out, lots of folks were buying more than one of these. So we created a buy more, save more. You pay 19.98 for the first one, and right. every one you buy after that, the price drops to 16.98. So it's and really you know, a great savings. If you love to make oven fries or even just bring home wings and skins and stuff for football mm. season, you can crisp them up in the oven. These are so good, it's crazy. I have to say. And they're so crispy. And they're nicely seasoned. Right? Yep. <laughs> I mean, whether you made them yourself or they're store bought, everything just gets crispier when the air can circulate all around it. Well, if I'm not mistaken, I think these were frozen fries, weren't they, Mitch? Yeah. Yeah. And something out of a out of a freezer case at the grocery store is this crispy on the outside. It's but so crunchy. And creamy on the inside. Yeah. The potato has not been dehydrated, mm. which is so important. So this is what's so crazy. Look how creamy they are on the inside, but crispy and crunchy on the outside. Jason, how many of these are gone now? They're delicious. Eleven hundred pans are gone, Miss Rachel. Same thing with your cookies. If you are a person that likes crisp cookies. Mm. They get super crisp on the bottom if the air can get all the way around mm. them. It's just delicious. It's a great little pan. Hey, I'll make a deal with you. What? I'll talk for the next 30 seconds and you have another fry. I can eat more fries. <laughs> I love working with David. Hey, let's remind you also that that tray that Rachel's mm. talking about does remove. So if you want to take this out and actually bake a pizza in here, like we did here, or put your cookies right on the tray, this could also be a great jelly roll pan as well. Or if you want to brown something under the broiler, pop it under the broiler. Like just to chicken get parm? Cheese. Yeah, to get your uh, cheese all browned up. It's just a great little tray. And I love it. And I love the crispy cheese in there. That's part of my favorite part. That's that's the best part. Yeah, right. Well, next to the super crispy French fries. Well, there's that. Um, all <laughs> right. So let's remind you that this is a buy more, save more. So every one you buy after the first one, the price drops to sixteen ninety eight. So you're saving money the more of these you buy. And they're really sturdy, guys. This is not a flimsy pan. It's not, not going to bend and get funky on you. Actually, we have another one down here. Yeah. Here we go. So yeah, I wanted to show you that this is. Really, really strong, and you're not going to have that thunder pan. I call them right. thunder pans. It twists and pops in the oven, goes yeah, boom. Because it does that warping in the oven. This is something that is no, really, these are really done. sturdy and great. We use these at the show. We tested the prototypes there. Everybody at my show just loves them. And you got commercial ovens at your show. Oh don't you? yeah, yeah, yeah. Hardcore. Yeah, they've got like restaurant ovens at her yeah. show. Um, so this is Everybody what's amazing. Everybody loves these. They're really, really fun. Oh, well, the fries are not bad either. Uh, this is nineteen dollars and ninety-eight cents. These are going very quickly. Sold out the last two days they were on the air, so we're thrilled to have these back. You may want to buy as many as you think you'll need for gifts coming up for the holidays. Hard to believe it's already almost the uh, going to be the. End I of the first Christmas week. shop all year long, so I am not in the weeds. We are Christmas. all. Almost, uh, uh. almost into the second week of September. Hard to believe already. So this is what it's all about. Take advantage of this. Don't miss out on your opportunity. We were so thrilled to have this back in April, but it did sell out completely. Look at this huge mm. beef roast. I mean, this is a prime rib. So look yep. how big that is. 
on that tray. How big is that roast, Mitch, would you say? I mean, people don't think of it, but... Seven pounds? These are really deep pans, too. They're not only rimmed, but they have an extra lip. Exactly. So if you're, if you're roasting a large piece of meat where you're going to get a lot of juices and drippings, maybe um, this will still be fine. Just shy of two inches deep, maybe. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's really a deep pan. Nice and deep. And if you take the, the insert tray out, it's even deeper. That's right. So that so, gives you even I more mean, room. You know, it, they're just a really useful piece of equipment. Like I said, everything I put my name on, it has to have form and function. It, it has to be the best value at its price. I don't ever want to be the cheapest. I want to be the best value for that price. And we love that. You well, know? in this case, because of QVC's buying power and our long relationship with our buddy Rachel, we're able to bring this in at under $20. It's unbelievable. It's a great, great buy. I mean, it should cost way more than that. When you feel the pan and you see it and it comes with the insert, you really know that that is just an amazing bargain. Remember also, when you're doing things like bacon, all the fats and oils that are rendered from that bacon now go down to the bottom of the pan, That's so right. the bacon starts resting in it. That's right, and it's easier to clean up. Once it's cold, you just wipe it out, <clears throat> discard the fat, and, and throw it in the dishwasher. So, real, and, and you know what? If this is a little too big for the dishwasher you have, warm soapy water in the sink is great of too. Of course, it takes yeah. two seconds. It's it a with no service. problem at all. So, yeah. look at the capacity again two whole roasting chickens. Huge platter of game day nachos, which is just fantastic. And I love that it can go under the broiler. Right, up to 500 degrees because there's no silicone on these. Here we did onion rings and mozzarella sticks, all crispy and crunchy. Yeah, it just looks like game day food, doesn't I know, it, really? Right? And then your pound of bacon, which is awesome. Look at the buffalo wings. Yeah, crisping up your wings, keeping cutlets crispy, uh, or if you made a big batch of fried chicken. Making a pan pizza. Look at the crust. See, I would have used the crisper on that. Would you? Yeah, I would have, because it gets that air going around, and the bottom I think would get even browner. Would even browner. But the okay. fries, I mean, these guys are so crisp, it's crazy. <laughs> and they're addictive, aren't they? They hey, really are. Let me tell you that when now over three thousand pans are gone. Well, for people that bake and people that cook, they're just super useful. And the and the reason I have we did, four of them upstate. Well, that's all I was just going to yeah. say. The reason we have a buy more, save more is you may want to keep one for roasting, one for baking, have a, having two or three of these on hand. And allows you to get more than well, one thing going in into the, the oven. holidays and my sister my god she bakes cookies well as you know you get a platter of them every week. <laughs> she bakes cookies for weeks she she needs as many as she can shove in the oven <laughs> I know I love it at, at Christmas time Rachel gives me a platter of her sister's cookies and they are delightful and I enjoy that's them. because Rachel doesn't bake she stinks at it Maria is the baker so I, I do the, the cooking. I thought the only thing you had trouble with was making coffee no, my coffee's terrible. That's true too. And I set bread on fire. That's true. I can bake. I should say that. I can bake. It's not my favorite. I prefer to cook. I Our like less just said, rules. Did less she rules. say bread on fire? <laughs> I set bread on fire all the time, as did my mother before me. Is that right? We are bread firing, setting fools. Well, you are, you are, you are a product of your environment, aren't you? If I have my husband bring home bread, John always brings home two packages of rolls, two loaves of whatever. Because he knows you're gonna set one on fire. Because he knows I'm gonna set one on fire. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so everybody, we want to remind you this sold out back in April when we had it on the air. And how many are gone now, Jason? Wow, 4,000 now are gone. $19.98, buy more, save more. Almost everyone's buying a second pan. For $3 less, you're looking at $16.98 for the second pan. Wow. Or as many as you want to buy after the first one. So you pay $19.98 for the first one, $16.98 for every pan you buy after that. We'll ship it all home to you. And now you've got a couple of pans in the kitchen, two or three for the different things you'll be making. And maybe, <clears throat> pardon me, maybe you have uh, dual racks in your oven or triple racks, and you can do you know cooking all at once. Oh, absolutely! It's perfect for all of that. So don't miss out on this opportunity. We're excited to have it back on the air. Hasn't been here since April when it sold out. And the it last sold time. out in minutes. Exactly. And that was the second time it had sold out. Today, very very popular. I've got a sneaking suspicion you might have this with Jane tonight too. If there's any left, right, exactly. I mean honestly, people just love these. They, I would they can't not. Live without Wait. them. All right. As I wrap this up, help yourself to another fry there, love. My and, God, you're um, so bad for me. I, I'm a fry pusher. <laughs> and uh, if you're having trouble getting through right now, you wouldn't be alone because we're so busy. Please use automated ordering, QVC mobile apps, QVC.com. We're very, very busy. Lots and lots happening for you. I understand that we've got Mopines right around the corner. My baby. That's another one of my babies. We are seven minutes away from the Mopine, and this is an item that Rachel created. Wait until you see how smart it is. Wait until you see the cool colors we have. And it's only about seven minutes away. So stick around. It's a full hour of the dish with Rachel Ray. We're coming right back after this short break. There's this other cooking show on TV. It's in the kitchen with, is his name Cletus? Uh, no, I think it's, isn't it David? I think it says it.